Hey there everyone, Hatesh here, back again with another video and welcome to the React Native series. In case you are new onto this channel, first of all, welcome to the channel. It's a channel with a lot of lot of things and we learn a lot of in-depth things right from the basics to very advanced one. So welcome back. Now we are running a React Native series right now. We have already done with the project one and in this video, I will introduce you to the project two, what we are about to make for this one. Getting to know about uh, what we're going to build is going to set some expectation on your ground that, hey, what extent we are going to learn in this section or the project two that we are going to build and all that. First, let me show you that. Then we'll discuss some more things that should be there. So let me just take you to uh, the one here. So here is what we are going to build next. So, yes, I totally understand. At first, this looks like, hey, this is very basics. We want to build something magical like a Tinder clone or maybe a WhatsApp clone. But that is a wrong direction to pursue because if you are not focusing on the basics and how things are done, then obviously just repeating after me mindlessly, cloning these WhatsApp and all of that is not going to make you an actual programmer. You need to push yourself by creating these clones, but basics, all the things and all the doubt should be learned in the class itself or this video itself. So what we're going to do and how we're going to proceed. First, we're going to learn about the flat cards and there is a goal behind it why we really want to do this. And notice here, by the way, the entire thing is scrollable. So that is also having an intention there. The first and foremost is a flat card so that you understand that how you can pack some element onto a screen from left to right. There could be three elements. There could be two elements. There could be more. So we'll understand that philosophy first. After that, we're going to learn about elevated cards. So these cards actually scroll from left to right. And we need to understand what goes in the mind behind doing that. Now, once you understand how we can rotate these cards from left to right, we'll learn about how we can create cards and card effects. So we'll have a title and then we have a card. This card, of course, has a lot of play around with the flex box. So we have an image at the top, then some text and then some text at the bottom as well. There will be a lot of room for you to improvement, surely. Then after that, we'll learn a different style of the card, which is blog-ish card, where we have title at the top, an image, then two buttons, which obviously can be improved in room. Now, after that, we will have a contact list, of course, inspired by WhatsApp or any other social media chatting application. Left hand side, we'll have some of these images, then a text and then simply a subtext of this. Now, once you understand how to build all of this, you can actually mix and match. Maybe you want to build something where you want to don't want to scroll these boxes. You want to scroll these cards, which looks like this. You can take these cards and mix your knowledge with these cards and can make them scrollable. Or maybe you want to fit three or four cards on the screen. You can take the knowledge from the top cards, mix it up with these kinds of card and can place them up here. Maybe you want to build a scroll view where your contact list actually scroll from top to bottom. You can actually go ahead and do that. You can mix and match your knowledge. And this is the true learning where you not only just take my code, but actually experiment with the code, the knowledge that you have picked up here and here and you mix and match them up. So this is exactly what we'll be learning in this particular section. Now, here's a big question or a big point where you should be focusing. Now, in the world of React Native, me or any book cannot teach you everything that is there. But what we're doing here is we are putting our attention to very focused ground. We are focusing on just the styles in this particular section. We, will, we are not bothered about how the camera works. How can I use local storage? How can I use Firebase? That's not the question. That is not the focus or attention at this time. All we are worrying about right now is how can I go ahead and master styling? How can I arrange components? How can I achieve a certain look which I really want to achieve? All of that is the focus. That is it. And that is the way how you can learn for it. So all the articles that you're going to be writing, all the study that you will be doing along with me is going to be focused on just styling. I know it, it is going to be a little bit boring, but this is the way to learn and actually properly become a mobile app developer. So that is it. Hope you are excited for the upcoming project. And from the next video onwards, we will directly jump by creating a project and start working on the flat cards. Let's go ahead and catch up in the next video. Hope you have already subscribed.